All right. Call off. Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to that. All the apostles of Great Millstone. Peace and blessings to all you brothers. Teaching in truth and sincerity throughout the four corners of the globe. You know, uh, this is uh, going to be just a little short uh, article. All right. And this is uh, hopefully what's to come. All right. In 2018, man. All right. Because for years, we've, we've been out there. Okay. When I say we've, talking about the elder apostles on down. All right. Of Great Millstone. Been out there. Uh, telling you that the Heavenly Father and His Son is about to come down with judgment. Upon this place, and not only them, but uh, you got Esau about to come down with great wrath. Okay, that he's going to be judged by. All right, and you know me just putting this out is just you know the man of the Lord has been vexed in the spirit with this for many years, man. Okay. With both sexes, lesbian and homosexual men, having uh, children in the household, uh, you know what I'm saying, just gotten abroad, man. We understand that this is Esau kingdom, all right? And what he has done was made it comfortable for these homosexuals to live, whether he be male or female, all right? But the Lord had enough, man. Okay, so the article here, like you can see in the capture, it says murdered lesbian couple and their two children found bound and with their throats slashed in an act of savagery in their upstate New York home. All right, so one, you know, I'm gonna get this scripture real quick. Bear with me. second I'm going to go to Isaiah 45 and 7 and like I said man this is this is probably a sign of things to come man all right and I'm going to read the Leviticus law that too. All right. It says, because you know how these Christians are. All right. This is Isaiah 45 and 7. It says, I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, do all these things. So, right away, you know, that's what I can think of because. Being in the truth, you're to hate the evil and love the good, okay? And this is a good thing that this happened, man, okay? Them kids were probably all mixed up in the head, all right? Uh, you know, the, the damn uh, Satan had those women, those women by their uh, nappy-ass weaves, man, all right? When I say that, I just mean that he had them beguiled, man. Confused all up, man. When the scriptures clearly say, 
All right. Anyone that lay with uh, mankind as a woman, okay, they shall surely be put to death. And in this case, it's womankind or mankind lay together. All right. They should be surely put to death because of the confusion that they bring, man. And those kids were probably confused, man. All right. And then the, you got the beastly looking older, the mother of the two, uh, having intercourse with a 22 year old, all right, whose mind was probably all mixed up from, from, from experience of, of, you know, other things, probably molestation and so on and so forth, man. You could just read into the situation and see, man, all right. But yeah, this was a quick little sit down of what's to come with these homosexuals, man. In the year 2018, man. The Lord is tired of this bullshit, man. Look at this. Not a shape, the myths place. Oh, I hate men. You know that's what was inside her head. But she don't have to worry about it no more, man. Because whatever death angel chose this this uh, domain to go in and, and bring them down, man. The Lord put them there, man. Alright? And this is it, man. Every time you, when you look into this, uh, this media outlet, it's always some type of weirdo shit going on, man. And it's sickening, man. So I hope the Lord uh, brings judgment on this place heavy, man, in 2018, man. Because this, this place got to go, man. There's no more sitting here comfortably in this, man.